Boom. Yeah. Big Slink. Hey. Boom. Hello there. Welcome back to World of Warcraft Durotar. Mm, okay, we're leaving Razor Hill now. I'm pretty sure we're all done here. Might come back for something, I don't know. But now we're traveling through this ravine up to uh, Gore the Enforcer. And, oh! Pew, hair. <laughs> Uh, just to remind you, uh, from last time I leveled up to level 10, so now I'm gonna let you guys choose my specialization. So if you want to help with that, go and comment on the last uh, video. If you want to... Uh, shooting all the critters here. If you want me to... Uh, if you want to help me choosing spec... or choose spec for me or whatever, then just go to the previous, previous video, episode... Was that episode 50, last one? Yeah, it was. That's kind of cool. <laughs> uh, pew! Pew! That's logical. Logical. Very logical. Uh, but yeah. Oh, snake! Adder. Yeah, go and do that. Uh, don't, don't do it in this episode, because I will see the other episode a day earlier, so... It probably... If I record th that same day, uh, this episode won't matter. If you try to vote here. And yeah, it all depends on. And it may be even too late to actually... Dip, blah, blah, I'm just gonna... No, 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 just not gonna... Not gonna speak anymore. Where is the guy? Oh, there he is. Yeah, Ted Nug again. He has a pet called Scratch Fever. A lion. Huh. So I got in the comments. I uploaded this episode yesterday where I saw him flying over. And I got in the comments that it's, it's a reference to a singer called Ted Nugent. And I replied with the Scratch Fever. I'm guessing that's maybe the name of a song or an album he's done. I don't know. Ooh, a goblet with a quest. Uh, but yeah, the only thing I recognize that name from, as I said in the comment, was uh, that 70s show. They have like an episode where they mention him and there's, yeah, t-shirts and stuff they, yeah, trying to sell. Rizlak, Tinker's Union. Try to ignore the firm, feathery uh, behinds of the harpies. The creatures are really quite deadly. Oh. Winds in the desert. I'm Reslak, one of Gazlo's boys. Boss sent me here to uh, help the orcs here. Sent me to help the orcs here in Dorotar. Things to be in. Things d. Can you say it like that? Things d. Ooh, alliance! Question mark, question mark, war warrior. I. I why can't I attack him? He is PvP. And I don't need to PvP to attack him. Right? That's odd. Maybe it's just in case because I'm such low level so that it doesn't give me the option, really. I think, yeah, because this character is from Ratchet, I think he can pick up those quests as well. Uh, Things have been going good except for the caravans. Can't manage to keep up, uh, keep them uh, safe. Makes my job a little harder, you know. The last shipment, which they promised would get through, was snatched by the Dustwind Harpies of, uh, where was it, Razorwind Canyon? I gotta have those supplies. Follow the big canyon to the south, and you'll find a ravine cut right into the west and east sides of the walls. Retrieve five sacks of supplies. Be good. Securing the lines. Gaslo told me once, Reslak, there's one thing you need to know in life, and that is if you want something done well, do it yourself. I can't just deal with losing all our caravans, so I'm just going to take matters into my own hands. Harpies plague our supply routes, uh, routes. Uh, if we kill the harpies, the caravans are safe. Of course, there was one other thing that Gaslo taught me, and that's, you can get anything uh, done for a price. You in, Glerda? Good. I recommend starting in the canyon to the east. Kill 12 Durtar Harpies. Any type of Harpy will suffice. Or suffice. Or English. Uh, ooh, new bow. Hickory short bow instead of Senjin bow. Have a good one. Ooh, should I do that first or should I? Eh, I kind of feel like there's not going to be anything else with the Harpies, so might as well go with the Harpies. So is that all? Oh, it's down there as well. Hmm. Hello, Common. Oh, it's the level 16 shaman from last episode in the cave. 
Why is the level 16 questing here? It's a bit too high level. Well, I don't know. Probably has its reasons. His or hers, or its. Will I shoot? Yeah. Nice. So, we have to run all the way back down to that little fork in the path. I'm, go I'm gonna go to this side first, just to check. Because we can either go... Well, how far is it? Is it down all the way down there, or...? The Dranosh uh, blockade is under attack! Maybe the Alliance guy we saw. Killing some NPCs or guards or something. And here we are. Harpy's dead. Racer Wind Canyon. Yay! Now we only have this little place, and then we have discovered the whole... Oh wait, that also up there. Um... Yeah... So I'm... Pre I'm pretty sure, yeah, this is just a small part of the Razorwind Canyon. Uh, whoop. So, it, yeah, it, it opens up here, so there's not much more in that stolen supply sack. Thank you, sack of supplies. I'm just gonna kill this one and then, yeah, as you can see, they have their nests hanging up here. And they have eggs on the ground everywhere. Pillagers and harpies and stuff. But yeah, we're... I just wanted to go here to actually see this place real quick. I can fast forward over to the other place, yes! Why did I... That's one, one thing with when I'm playing World of Warcraft as opposed to playing other uh, games is that the music in this game is a bit lower than in normal games, and it's constantly playing. It's well, it's not constantly constantly playing as well as it is with uh, other, most other games. Like for example, Star Wars Adventures. That I'm still waiting for. I, I sent it in, and I'm just waiting for it, them to repair it so I can get it back. And hopefully it will work. Otherwise, I don't know what to do. Uh, but yeah. So the whole reason behind this, why I'm saying this is. That I noticed, like you can hear the bus from the coming from the camera microphone. That is because you can hear like the uh, camera engine. Would you call it that? I don't know. But you can hear the buzzing from it more when I'm playing World of Warcraft, since the music is not as loud and as constant as in other games. So it kind you kind of well, at least I notice it a lot. Maybe you guys don't, and maybe I ruined it for you now <laughs> because now you've been listening to for it and now you hear it. I don't know. I, I'm just a bit quality picky when it comes to things like that. And as soon as I get some more money when I get a job, I will be like my first priority when it's... Oh, Dustwin Savage. First priority when it comes to uh, my videos is to get a good microphone that I can use for a Let's Plays. Because I do have a microphone that I bought, like, even before I bought this camera. Uh, but I can't really use that for Let's Play, because it's standing on the table, and it's picking up, like, every little tap on the keyboard and everything. So, it's kinda... where are the sacks of supplies? So it's... I can't use that to record Let's Play, I only use it for, like, voices for Machinimas or other types of voiceovers that I do, or uh, acapellas, mainly for the acapellas, because then I don't have to touch the table, I just have to record it with the microphone. Go two more harpies, but I need to find more sacks. Are there no sacks? Oh, the sacks are all out there. Storm witch. Hmm, maybe there will be more quests when I'm supposed to go in here in this part of the ravine. Yeah, this is Gry This is actually a ravine. The other one was a canyon. So this is Drygol's ravine. Uh, yeah, I'll go back out and uh, get the bags. Oh crap! Already respawned? Really? Well, you're in the way. Um, yeah, so, as I was saying, I cannot use that microphone for less playing, so... That, that is priority number one that I need to get, I feel. Even though this, like, the, the built-in mic in the camera, it's totally, it's, it's totally fine, but... Uh, yeah, I'm picky. I'm being picky. Being very picky. <gasps> Sec up there. They respawn very, very fast. I was just here. I was just here. Yep. We're gonna have to kill at least one extra. There. 
we go. Uh, stolen supply sack one is no, that's a copper vein, silver leaf. Oh, over there. Okay, that will be it. Kind of don't have to use the steady shot that much because you do have enough uh, focus to just spam a few arcane shots and then if you just regenerate back in between the, the battles. I wouldn't really call it battles, it's more like me murdering. This is a weird path to take over the brazier. <laughs> ah, NPC pathing, they should fix that. Or maybe they like put him at point A, go to point B, and then he happens to... I don't, I don't know. I don't know, let's get back to uh, Reslak. Why did you stop? There we go. It's called Reslak. Uh, yeah, Reslak. Reslak it was. And hopefully we'll have the time at that to maybe go up there. Depends on if we get more quests from Rizlak. And I have a feeling we will to go into the Dragos Ravine where we were. Time is money, friend. I'm great at what I do. Don't get me wrong, but this is ridiculous. What am I supposed to do? Build sandcastles? Hey, now, isn't that just the thing? You've got our supplies back for us. That's great. I'll be able to get back to work just as soon as I can find someone to haul these sacks for me. You, you have a deal. card here. Well, you can't really pull it by yourself and you don't seem to have any, anim any, 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 any animals. Uh, uh, okay, securing the lines. I, I think I can breathe easy now, knowing that the harpies won't be bothering our supply caravans anymore. And not one moment too soon either. I hear I'm being sent some little fun little toys with the next shipment. You're pretty good at what you do, Glirda. You ought to track down my boss in Ratchet. Uh, I'll bet he could find some work for you. Oh, and don't worry. I wouldn't forget to pay uh, you for the service you provided me. Thank you for new bow. Have a good one. Okay, there were no new quests. And yeah, I already met your boss, Gaslow, in Ratchet. We did that in Northern Mars as well. So we'll keep heading north because we do have the time. Now let's equip the bow while we're running. Hickory short bow. Wait. It's almost exactly the same, but it's okay. It's color change, I guess. Well, we can finally go up there, and I, might be a quest here. Might be some over here. I'm pretty sure there's some over here, but we're almost done now. Oh yeah, outside Orgrimmar, a lot of dueling players. So we're gonna see that. Dranoshar blockade. And that's all this and whoa, all this. Well you cannot see all of it because there's a lot of cliffs in the way. And we have to run all the way all the way around this house to be able to get to that guy. <laughs> Shin Stone Pillar. And, oh, here, Gord the Enforcer. Strength and Look far, Ugar, soldier. You're the one who handled the burning blades to the south. I've got ears in all kinds of places, my girl, and word travels fast. The flood to the southwest wiped out one of the few burning blade camps that still pockmark Durata. This one was led by a goblin named Fizzle Darklaw. And believe me, we are better off without him. Darklaw, uh, Darklaw, however, did possess an orb that the Horde is interested in procuring. Who knows why? I leave that to the warlocks. All I know is that I need that orb. Obtain Fizzle's orb from Fizzle Darklaw in Thunder Ridge. I imagine he'll look a little more waterlogged by the time you get to him. So yeah, I remember the ooh green item actually, but it gives me intellect, which I don't need. But it does give me extra armor as well. So yeah, uh, I do remember him. There was a quest to kill him before, but now that place has been flooded, so he's dead. Thunder down under. Our army needs water, and luckily the elements gave us plenty of that when the cataclysm hit. The water that filled up the canyon to the southwest should do the trick. Unfortunately, the corpses of Thunder Lizard still sit at the bottom of the canyon, and their electrical discharges are a bit too dangerous. I've got grunts that can lift them out of the water, but we need someone agile enough to attach the other end of the rope. 
Are you my woman, Glirda? Attach a mage weave thither to eight drowned thunder lizards in Thunder Ridge. Well, oh! Water breathing for ten minutes. Oh. Well, I'm going to end this episode. I'm just gonna get this first. My associate here has some plans for you that I don't agree with. His actions are hasty, uncontrolled, and irresponsible. And you may end up paying for them with your life. Before you work with Gore, first listen to the tale that I have to tell. It's a moralistic uh, story. A fable. But I believe its lesson will prove valuable. Speak to me when you are ready. Hear the moral of Shin Stone Pillar story. Well, we're gonna have to save that for next time. And I'm gonna have to end it here. Eh? Okay, that's odd. Uh, but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time, and hopefully I will be ready to choose a spec then. Yeah, goodbye!